Suppose you want to animate a change in elevation of a widget and a change in its uh, rounded corners and also animating the shadow that is resulting from the elevated position of the widget. How can you achieve this in Flutter? In Flutter, you can use animated physical model widget for this purpose. In this video, you will learn how to use this widget and animate these properties. Here we have a material app displaying a demo box at the center of the app and this demo box is responsible for showing this title bar here and the light blue background colored placeholder widget here. And the code that we want to build is present in animated physical model widget demo which is responsible for displaying the green colored container with the Flutter logo here. Let's take a look at the class animated physical model widget demo. Animated physical model widget demo is a stateful widget which implements its state using the class animated physical model widget demo state. And this state class is building a widget that is containing a column as a root widget. And this column has a physical model as its child. And this physical model in turn contains a container showing a Flutter logo at its center. Physical model widget here is a utility widget that represents a physical layer that clips its children to a shape. For example, here we have a container containing the Flutter logo and when we wrap it inside the physical model widget, it is adding a physical layer with the green color as its background. Not only that, you can add elevation to this physical layer and also rounded corners. So when you need to shape a widget in your app, physical model can be a useful widget to add elevation and a shadow and a border radius. And in a situation where you don't want to use a card widget for the same purpose. And now what we want to implement is to add a change button at the bottom here and whenever we tap on that button we want to add elevation and shadow and change the background color of the child widget that is being wrapped by the physical model widget. For this we are going to use animated physical model widget so that we can animate the properties nicely. Let's take a look at the implementation. So for that, let's start adding the properties elevation with an initial value of zero and border radius also with an initial value of zero. And then in order to change these properties, we need a trigger for that we will add a raised button and this raised button whenever we tap on it, we will change the state from a flat state to a elevated state. So let's have a state variable called is flat and let's start the initial state as in the flat end state. So let's keep it true and then let's use this variable to change the properties whenever its value changes. So whenever is flat is true, we will show a green color in the background. Otherwise, we will show a white color as the widget background and elevation as well whenever the is flat is true we will show zero elevation and whenever is flat is false we will show an elevation of 16 and similarly border radius as well we will increase it to 30 whenever is flat is false and now if we run this code we can see the button appearing here Let's add some space between the physical model widget and the raised button. For that, we can simply add a sized box, with the height of 20 and, and run this code. We can see the space up here. And now let's uh, tap on the change button, but nothing happens here. Uh, that's because even though we are changing the is flat variable state variable, it is not updating the widget. That's because we are not calling set state. Without calling set state method, updating the state variable will not have any effect. So let's call this inside set state method and run this code. And now we can see the change in the uh, properties of the widget. 
Now if we tap on the button, it will flip between a flat state and an elevated state. We can also change the color of the shadow for the physical model. So for that, we can simply add the shadow color property and give it a color and run this code. You can see the green color shadow appearing here. So now we are able to change between two different states of the physical model. One is in the flattened state and another in the elevated state. But we are not able to animate these changes. For that, let's change our physical model into animated physical model and provide it with a duration for the animation. Let's give it a 1500 milliseconds. And now let's run this code. And it is throwing an error that a shape attribute is missing. So let's add the mandatory shape variable and provide it with a box shape rectangle another option is a box shape with circle but since we are dealing with rectangle shape we are providing here box shape with rectangle let's run this code now and now we can see the error has gone away and now let's tap on this button now you can see that all the properties are nicely animating switching between the two states from the flattened state to the raised state so to summarize, whenever you find yourself in the situation of uh, animating the properties such as elevation and border radius and along with the shadow color, you can use animated physical model widget and, and change between the values for the color, elevation and border radius and the shadow color as well.